the teaser. Okay. Okay, so we're doing a sideline hamstring assisted with a strap and internal external rotation of the hip. So let's do the hip first. We'll go five reps each and then into the hamstring. So first straighten your bottom leg. Top knee's gonna come and rest on the block, adjusting so that's at, at a nice distance so it's under the knee, straight out from the hip. Make sure this leg is at a 90 degree angle, okay? Hip on top of hip, shoulder on top of shoulder. All right, so first you're gonna put a little pressure down into my hand with your heel and just work on connecting with the inner thighs, maybe a little bit in the pelvic floor. Easier on this side or harder on this side? Easier. Easier on this side, interesting. Okay, so you're gonna slowly feel me start to lift your foot up, just stay lightly connected to it on a scale from zero to 10, you're at about a two for muscle contraction. Good, relax to bring it down, press down. Good, good. And you're gonna go together. And push down. This is three. The next two, we're going to twist through, press down lightly. Okay, I'm gonna hold it here, stay lightly connected, heel into my hand, and roll the pelvis away from me. It's not gonna move very far, but let it roll back a little bit, good. Can't. That's okay, no, just go to where you can. It's very different on each side. Come back into it. Let's do that one more time, keeping connected heel. I'm gonna lower you a little bit into my hand. Good. Okay, and then a little twist back. Just go to where your body, Make the, start with the movement from the pelvis and then the body. Mm -hmm. Yep, just go to where it can. And then back again. So we're identifying when we did the first side with this, you're able to twist much more open and comfortable, but you have less connection of your inner thigh. Here you have more inner thigh connection, less mobility to go back. Okay, bring this heel up. Now we're gonna reverse it. You're gonna press your heel up into my hand. So we're getting the outer glute ITB area. And I'm gonna slowly push your leg down until it taps my thigh. Good. Engage your abdominals a little bit extra here. So you're kind of even gathering up the transverse, the side body on the left, so it, as it feeds into your hip. Good connection that made it a lot stronger when you came from that first. Relax to bring it up, press up, find my hand. Good, and back up one more. Good, okay. So now we're gonna go hamstring sideline. So this one, Literally just brand new, made it up. Okay, bottom leg is What should I be doing with my hands? Wherever you're comfortable, bottom arm, I typically kind of bring it up underneath the head a little bit. This hand is nice to have flat kind of in front of the chest to help secure your body, shoulder on top of shoulder, hip on top of hip. All right, tighten the tummy a little bit so you're giving yourself nice solid support here. All right, here comes the strap. All right. So I'm kind of on this diagonal here. All right, so make a connection first with the strap. You're resisting your leg as if it wants to sweep behind you. Wait until you feel the contraction in your left butt, left hamstring. Keep that core lightly engaged. You'll feel me start to pull you forward. Let yourself move the leg from the hip. So you'll let the leg come forward. Keep the hip slightly back. So I don't want them to come together. We're trying to separate the front line of the body from the back leg. Keep connected to the strap. Do a little tighter here, a little less connection here, I feel like. Or do, what do you feel like? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's come back together. I'm gonna walk you back. Stay firm in that leg. You're a couple inches from the ground. Okay, kick that leg back. Find the resistance, hamstring, glute. Yep, you can even bring this hand up onto the hip here to, to make sure it stays put and doesn't come with your leg as mm -hmm. I bring it forward. Keep it there, that helps. That helps a ton. Good, dive into that hamstring. Turn your foot up to the sky, just a touch. Up to the other way, up. there you go, just right there. Now press back into the, this strap again. I'm, I'm gonna change the strap here. Let's go back. Better? Mm -hmm. Okay, you're kicking back. Bring, bring it down now, so feel there you it. go. Now feel the hamstring. Do you feel it? Mm -hmm. Do you feel the glute? Mm -hmm. Okay, let the bend happen at the hip. Focus your energy 
into the muscles contracting in your in your hamstrings and glutes. Keep pressing it back. There. Good job. Good job. This one needs a little neuro re-education. So let's bring that leg back, sweep it back, contracting the hamstrings, glutes, and core to do it. Let's do one more. You're kicking back. Good. Dive into where you need it. There you go. Good, Chris. Excellent. Do you feel that more? Mm -hmm. That connection is really, really good. And bring the leg back. Good. And let it rest. Way to go. Oh. Hard. Yep. 